gonna be there soon. Over the Moon is Netflix's latest animated film, and it's based on the Chinese legend of the Moon Goddess. It follows a 12-year-old girl named Fei Fei, whose mother tells her about Chang'e, a goddess who lives on the moon, waiting for her true love. So when Fei Fei's mother passes away, she's determined to go to the moon to meet Chang'e. You and me, Bungie, we're gonna prove she's real. What in the world? The star-studded cast includes John Cho, Sandra Oh, Margaret Cho, and Ken Jeong as this dancing light-up otter thing. The story is set in one of China's famous water towns. To make sure their portrayal was accurate, the team went to Wuzhen, a water town in eastern China. We tried to go to places that were more unexpected and so beautiful but lesser known and kind of showcase China that way. We actually went like door to door and just knocked on doors and asked people if we'd come in and see their house. And people were so warm and welcoming and they're like, yeah, come in. And one of the um, houses we went to, uh, you know, had like a very enthusiastic Chinese grandmother that wanted to like really share about her experiences growing up in the town. And it was really quite an amazing experience. We made sure that everything that we were portraying was as authentic as we could, but we wanted it also to feel like anybody from the world could relate to the humanity in this. I can understand and appreciate how unique this culture is and the way that they live and you know how they sit and eat together and the foods that they eat. Our production designer, she, I think, took a million photos. In one family dinner scene, you can see the family eating hairy crabs, a seasonal fall dish, lion's head meatballs, a local specialty, and deep-fried spring rolls, a classic festive dish in eastern China. Moon cakes. Check. Bungee cords. Check. We have bungee. Check. I think a lot of people around the world are experiencing grief right now. I think the greatest part about this film is that it's about healing. We get to watch this young girl who's lost her mom at a young age understand that she can let her mom go while still celebrating the person that her mom was before. To be able to share the, the story of Chang'e with audiences who've never heard it felt like such an honor and such um, a privilege to do that. And and we always would just like look at each other and be like, wouldn't that be crazy if just like kids in the US would just know the word Chang'e and know that it's about the moon goddess? I remember picking up my son from preschool. I think he was only like three. And he was like, um, mommy, I was telling my friends at school about Chang'e. And I was like floored. To him, it's, it's just like another story that we've told him, you know? And I just thought, this is what, it, this is what we were trying to do. We're not gonna make it. Don't be such a chicken. Yeah. Ah!